Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Capricorns. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all is well, Capricorns. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves. Shout out to the Evolving Spirits. Shout out to the Soul Tribe members, gang, gang. Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support. Thank all of you for your continuous support, your feedback, your comments. I see you. I hear you in those comments. I thank you so much, Capricorns. I appreciate you. All right. I'm so glad that the readings are resonating for you, okay? If you're new here, welcome, all right? Definitely don't forget to subscribe, be a part of family, right? Welcome back to the ones that are returning, okay? Thank you as well for always and your your likes, your comments, your shares, and your support. I appreciate you all, all right? So let's dive into it here, Capricorns. We're first going to start with the Moonology card here, all right? For this week here, we're going to see what messages your guardian angels and your ancestors have for you, all right? Shout out to the ones that has been utilizing the color gold this week, all right. Yes, we are finishing up this week with the color gold. All right. Definitely. I enjoyed it myself. All right. So definitely if you're new here, don't forget to keep up with the community tab as well. All right. I do post daily enlightenment there and ways to evolve just spiritually, mentally and emotionally. Right. And definitely if you are a returning subscriber, go ahead and click that join link down below. All right. I do also have another private community that where we post uh, daily content there as well, all right? So I do post daily content to there as well, all right? You should definitely check that out. Click that join link down below, all right? So let's move forward here, Cappies. Let's first start here again with the Moonologies. Stick around. I'm going to use the tarot deck here to dive into that love life of yours, right? We got to see what's going on with Capricorn's love life. And yay. All right. And then we'll finish up with the hidden oracle deck for you. So let's see here, guardian angels. Protect my space and aura as I channel the messages here, please, for Capricorn placements. What do they need to know for this week here? What do they need to know for the end of September here? What messages here do we have for my Cappies? What do Capricorns need to know here, Guardian Angels? Okay, thank you. Let's see. We have the energy is gaining momentum. Hmm. Waxing moon here, okay? So something is definitely cooking here for you, okay? There's three birds there. That's very significant, okay? The number three, which no, we know that is feminine energy, all right? This could be referencing to stepping into your feminine energy here, balancing, you know, the way how you feel out here when it comes to your feelings and your emotions, tapping in with yourself, okay? When it comes to whatever this situation that is gaining momentum here, right? Okay, wow. So I feel like there is a particular situation or circumstance here during this week of September or ending the month here of September that has been gaining momentum, okay? Right, this is gaining energy here to communicate with someone or exchange energies here with someone or whatever this is that you could be possibly manifesting here for yourself, Capricorns, okay? And the energy is gaining momentum towards whatever this is that you have manifested here, okay? All right, wow. Thank you, Gordon Angels Ancestors, for those messages. Definitely if that resonated, Cappies, in regards to your current situation. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and the notification bell, love. Let's now dive into your love life, okay? Let's see what's going on when it comes to love for Capricorn. What do we have for my Cappies? What do they need to know when it comes to love? What is a potential outcome here for Capricorn's love life here for the end of September here? What do they need to know when it comes to love? What do we have for Capricorns when it comes to love? Let's see, Cappies. All right, first card we have out. We have is the Nine of Pentacles here, Okay. So this talks about that energy here of being independent, right? This is also earth energy, okay? So you're definitely in your element here, Capricorns, right now. You're feeling yourself, honey. Okay, fuck it up, all right? And you're not letting anything bother you or get in your way here, okay? You're really tuned in with yourself now. I feel like a lot of you all are doing some, you know, reading, 
researching, you're doing some healing here, learning something new here for others of you all, studying, going back to school here, okay? Focusing more inward, right, towards what makes you happy, what is going to give you the potential, the success, and the guidance here that you're needing spiritually here, I feel as well, okay? You're definitely tuned in with yourself, you know, just minding your own business, drinking your wine here, honey, okay? And just being very fruitful at this time, you know? Everything that you have, you know, been through, you definitely made lemons out of lemonade now, right? And it's beautiful. And you're looking beautiful as well, Capricorns. Fuck it up. And I feel like this particular person here sees this as well, okay, in you. All right, yeah, look at that. We have the hangman here, okay? This card is Pisces energy here particularly, okay? But this talks about, you know, going through that spiritual awakening, all right? Going through the experience of, you know, understanding by the decisions that we have made, right? Or where we're at and where we're going, okay? And this is that particular energy where is why he is hanging from this tree because, you know, he doesn't experience through the good experiences that really made a big impact on his life. And then he's also now have experienced, you know, the things that he learned valuable lessons from, right? Choices due to choices that he has made to put him in situations. So now he has the ability here to just sit in peace and quiet, okay? Now being able to experience from both sides of the, you know, the fence here, now he can just wait, right? Now he can just rest. Now he feels at peace because he knows what both sides is experiencing of like, okay? So I feel like there's a lot of reading, waiting, okay? Just minding your business, tending to yourself here, okay? And I feel like this particular person here, for some of y'all, could be watching you. Wow, yes, I was feeling that energy here, okay? Some of y'all Capricorns, this person here may be a water sign here. This is Scorpio energy here, all right, okay, this particular person here is definitely someone here that, you know, is emotionally controlled here, okay, meaning that their emotions is not all over the place. They're very balanced when it comes to their emotion when they're able to be at the status here of the king of cups, okay, so very emotionally balanced here, okay. Some of y'all, you definitely have a Scorpio that is eyeing you here, Capricorns, or again, they could be a Pisces or a count searing as well here, Capricorns. But this is a masculine energy here uh, for some of you all Capricorns that has been watching you. You see how he has that? And it's crazy because before this card came out, I said, I feel like someone is watching you, uh, Capricorns, okay? And then he has this right here, okay? He has that little telescope where I can't, I forgot what you call those, right? But he has that in his hand because he's looking over shore, right? Or over the ocean or the sea here. So as I mentioned that, it's funny how the, I'm, they're showing me that. I'm, I didn't even recognize that he had that in his hand there. I swear every, oh, and I don't, I don't like swearing, but I, I noticed like every time I mention or feel, I they pointed out to me in the pictures. And I've looked at these pictures on these cards so many times and didn't even notice he had that in his hand. Okay, so that's very significant. Someone is definitely watching you. Okay, this person could be at a distance from you as well here Capricorns okay but you definitely have an individual that's watching you here and they're waiting as well here okay Capricorns oh wow so let's see what they want to say Capricorns since they are watching and waiting okay some of y'all this person is literally manifesting you okay wow and it's like again like I said you guys are tending definitely to your own crops here okay all right let's see here what do we have how does this person feel towards Capricorn Wow, definitely if they're resonated, my loves, I do am available for personal readings, all right? If you would love to book a personal reading with me, all that information is down below in the description box. I am back now available for personal readings, okay? So let's see here, Cappies. Let's see what this particular person wants to say. I want to see how they feel since they're coming out in this King of Cups feeling here, okay? Let's see. Let's see what they want to tell you or how they feel feel here. Mm. 
we have I want to kiss your hot spot. Well, well, well. Okay. So this person is definitely doing a lot of fantasizing about you here in other areas. Okay. So not only is this person watching you over here. Okay. But this is part of that reason why. Okay. Because they're doing a lot of thinking about you. Okay. This person could be definitely having dreams about some of you all here as well. Okay. Wow. All right. They may watch your pictures. Okay. They may... Um, I just seen the card. Let's take it slow. Okay. So some of y'all, this person wants to take it slow with you. All right. They want to take their time getting to know you. I'm picking up here as well. And then I seen a card that says facts. Okay. So some of you all, uh, this is just confirmation for you in regards to this person and what you've been feeling about this person as well here. And then we have Libra here that came out here. Okay. Very significant there, Capricorns. Some of y'all, this particular person here could be a Libra here. Okay. Where the energy is gaining momentum on here for you too. Wow, Cappies. Let's see what else comes out here as we close out your reading today. Again, definitely if the reading has resonated so far, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, loves. Definitely, I would love to see where this energy is going to go here in the future. Wow. Let's see. What do we have come out? We have you are all that matters to me. Oh, that's so sweet. Uh, when when that king of cups, when that scorpion, when that water energy knows how to express itself, you better believe that they will, okay? So as I mentioned, because this is like a very determined person here, they're definitely watching you, observing you, okay? But this person definitely takes their time and want to take their time getting to know you, okay? For ones that this person is new here, someone that you're getting to know here, okay? Others of you all, this person only see you as mattering to this person right now, besides anything else or anyone else here okay wow libra's beautiful spread here my loves definitely again if the reading has resonated don't forget to like subscribe hit the notification bell loves definitely again if you're new here don't forget to join that link down below all right again you can join the soul tribe i do provide discounts on personal readings email questions and we also have our own private community where i do post daily content as well all right definitely my loves thank you all capricorns for your continuous love and support and as i always say my loves your health is your wealth all right take care of yourselves cappies i'll talk to you soon Mwah. Bye-bye.